back on the side of the house. Beautiful. Right, and this particular property, again, this is what you want if you're trying to start over, go for the long game, right? This is a triplex priced at 199. It's 199 because it's condemned. So they broke through the wall to get to that other unit. No way, dude. Somebody was doing work in here. Secure this place with the wall. Yeah. Jesus. There's a room over there. I think I can get through. The floor the, seems pretty sturdy. I'm waiting for the floor to get soft. Damn, this is a big <laughs> unit. Welcome to the Investment Properties for Sales Show. Folks, thing is selling at or above list. We are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education. We take you to the video tour. Won't watch TV, giving it to you straight. Y'all, I love the Clark Fulton area, and I got an opportunity for you. But it's going to require some work, man. 3221 West 41st, Cleveland, 44109. Right there. Right in the heart of the Clark Fulton area, folks. I love it. I usually call it the Metro Health area, right? Because Metro Health, in my opinion, is the biggest draw over there. Right? This is a low-income neighborhood right now, folks. And there ain't no shortage of low-income neighborhoods in Cleveland, right? But this particular one happens to be right by Metro Health, which makes it very important because Metro Health is investing over a billion dollars into their campus and the surrounding community, this community, okay, and this particular property. This is the kind of property you want in a neighborhood that is potentially going to see a ton of appreciation and gentrification from things like billion-dollar investments or from the fact of where it's located, right? The other neighborhoods in Cleveland that have seen the most gentrification, appreciation, Ohio City, Tremont, Gordon Square. Well, guess what? This neighborhood's right next to all those, and it's getting a billion bucks, right? And this particular property, again, this is what you want if you're trying to start over, go for the long game, right? This is a triplex priced at nineteen nine. It's nineteen nine because it's condemned, right? It just got condemned. Uh, the situation here is squatters uh, actually broke into this thing and lived in there for a while. Uh, and then the, eventually the squatters were evicted, but not before they set the house on fire, right? So it's all boarded up. It's condemned. It's all type of messed up, right? So it's going to require a full-on rehab, or it might potentially be something where you may just want to tear it down and take advantage of the new housing construction tax credits they're given, right? If you're in an area like this, which is getting a bunch of uh, big-time infrastructure, right, Building new construction might be key, and the city is going to incentivize you because they will give you a 15-year tax abatement on the valuation of your new property, right? So say you buy the land for two or $20,000, right? You buy the land for $20,000, and then you build, let's just say, an $800,000 structure on the land. For 15 years, all you got to do is pay property taxes on the $20,000 land. You do not have to pay property taxes on the eight hundred dollars structure, right? So you could save hundreds of thousands of dollars, right? That is how Ohio City, Tremont, Gordon Square got to be where they are today. Or the other alternative is you could totally renovate this thing, put it back together, and generate about $2,400 a month in rent now, potentially uh, going with the Section 8 program, why it's still like a lower-income neighborhood, and then maybe 10 years down the road uh, when I believe that gentrification and all that stuff is really going to pick up and this neighborhood's going to be really worth a lot more, you could possibly do something a little different, right? So from here, all you got to do is submit your as-is cash offers. If before you submit your as-is cash offers, you want to tour the property or take your contractor in there to tour it with you so you can put together a scope of work on how much it's actually going to cost to put this thing back together, that's totally cool, man. Shoot us an email, sales at holdenweiss.com. Hit us up before 5 o'clock. We'll get you in there same day. If it's after 5 o'clock, it'll be the next day. And then after that, I just want your as is cash offer. Shoot me an email. Hey, man, 3221 West 41st. Here's my proof of funds. I want to pay 20 k cash. No questions asked, right? Send all those to sales at holdenweiss.com. If you're looking for lenders, folks, uh, we could hook you up with financing. 
when you want to refi it out. But we're only going to be taking cash offers on this one. But we do have a bunch of resources for you guys who would like to maybe do a bird deal on this, pull your cash out. If you're interested in my list of lenders, I could hook you up with those two, right? I've done $200 million worth of sales just like this one. Uh, I've been working at this for over a decade. I've curated a list of a lot of lenders who loan to investors just like you. Investors in all 50 states. They even loan to foreign national investors, right? People in Canada, the UK, all kinds of people invest in neighborhoods like this. And I got lenders to set you guys up uh, for that long-term financing. So if you need my list, I'll hook you up with that. And heck, you might even just be watching this because you like the entertainment value we provide here on Holton Wise TV, but you might actually be investing in Detroit or maybe you're investing in Indianapolis or something like that. If you guys need lenders, I'll hook you up with that list as well. Sales at HoltonWise.com for my lenders and to submit your offers. Let's go. They got their little tie off here so like people can't bust it on them doing the drugs. Yeah. I don't know, man. This might be like rent ready, dog. I mean, for this street, what it seems like. Secure this place with water. Yeah. yeah. Jesus. There's a room over there. I think I can get through. This floor the, seems pretty I was sturdy. Say, I'm waiting for the floor to get soft. Damn, this is a big fucking unit. You probably could have got it. This shit probably could have got like a couple hundred bucks for this. Oh, is that a Michael Jordan rookie car, dude? No, it's not. Probably needed. Oh, man. More nettles. I don't. I don't think people in this area will be doing drugs up here, dude. Couple more two tree needles. And police broke the windows out. All right, firefighters broke all the windows out. It smells like fireworks. Right? Oh, that's good. Damn, dude, I bet some nasty stuff went on in here. Real nasty. This stuff right in there. I don't even know what the fuck that is. I've never seen anything like that before. Well, I guess maybe it's a weed pen. <sighs> Fucking rallies cup. Okay, so. Securing this unit's not gonna do a bad thing either. No. Okay, so here's the kitchen. I didn't see a bathroom in here. Is it this room over here? Mm, yeah, I think so. There's also an upstairs portion here. Can't get in there though. I'm not going to move all that shit. But the... Yo! Yeah. Uh, I don't think it is. I don't believe so. Ah! Living the dangerous life, dude. Right. Alright, I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit and head upstairs. Yeah. Oh, it's like a whole nother room up here. Oh no, it's not. It's just a traditional attic. Oh, it's hot in here. It was just a little too hot to do drugs, I think. Up here. Oh!
Yeah. I'm not gonna walk back there. This is all burn up real bad. Beautiful kitchen. There you go. No appliances. Seven ninety five a month. You got a lot of shots in here. Right? Yeah, yeah. I swept the room a couple times. Oh. Did this room? I'm not going back there. It's a lot of flies. Mostly aired out, dude. Yeah. Watch your step on the nail right there. Oh, I know. Avoid well, there's a door here we can screw shut. I mean, that'll help. Uh, screws. Oh. Yeah, but Tom might. You guys got screws, right? Because we can just screw these doors shut. I mean, Best we can. No, shit. Oh man, they moved in the furniture we moved out. Hey, they broke through the damn wall. Huh? So they broke through the wall to get to that other unit. No way, dude. Somebody was doing work in here. That's a real man's ladder. More needle caps. If you recall from the sales video, well, this was the room that they were in here doing drugs in. So rather than just break in the front door over there, they just fucking rip the wall out. You gotta love that crackhead ingenuity, man. This is the room we caught him fucking shooting up. Yep. Jury duty, baby. Friday Night Lights. There's a couple of boards here. Basement access is right here for this unit. This was the kitchen. I remember that. I mean, actually, it's a little better than I expected it to be. If I'm being 100% honest. Oh, it's Damn, it's those days just sitting here pooping on the floor. Poop. Sounds all right. Guess sometimes you gotta. No, I can't get a shot of that. Sometimes you just gotta poop on the floor. It's all good. Oh, yo, what? I'm not going down there. Look at this. Fucking smells like death down there. I guess I'll go down here. I ain't no bitch. Uh. There's a rickety as shit. The things I do, you YouTube fuckers better. Oh, ho, ho. so I don't know how familiar you people are with houses, but usually there's a furnace attached to that, and like pipes and shit. <laughs> Okay, let's see, last time I was here, there was a hot wall. Oh, there's one left. Didn't scrap this one yet. But there was another one, big one over here. 
They probably got it in the video from the first time we was here. There was a big one right here. You can see um, that's gone. What kind of atrocities went on down here? Oh my God. Damn. Jeez Louise. All right, well, we got two utility sinks. Here's your power, it's all, you know, it's gone, that's cool. These fuckers stole everything out of here. Goddamn crackheads. And then you can just come out this back way here. I'm gonna shift on the property. You know, the essentials. Here's the back of the house. You can see, we were up there. That was all burned out. There's a bug on me. Basement. Back on the side of the house. Beautiful. I did. Guess what's gone? The rest of the furnace that was there no. from the first time. No way. And the big hot water tank. What? Yeah. There's yes. still one there. They must we they must have been in the process of scrapping that. So basically you said you gotta board it all up. Okay. Pretty much any entry point on the first floor that's not already boarded up, you gotta board it up. Okay. So he's messaging John. Let's see if they can run the Cleveland lumber or whatever. Yeah, I don't know. Well, see, I kind of just gave Jen the option. I said, it needs to be all boarded up. Should the city take care of it? Oh, will the city do it? No, do it. Oh, yeah, we want that. Right. Yeah, it's probably. It's better. Probably better if they do it. Anyway. Were we able to get in the front unit yet? You can go through the wall. I'm not going through the wall. I'm not a crackhead. <laughs> That's what I asked. The cool guy. Do you need to get in there? We can, we can, I crawled through the hole. Okay. It's a smaller unit. Yeah, it's. They've been in there. You can tell because you know they dug a hole through the wall. Yeah. I but. Know. Okay. When we posted notices, yeah, they were all standing over here. They had the bikes all in here. Yep. Mm -hmm. They start walking down. They scatter. Yeah. That's the part that pisses me off. Is like by scattering, you're acknowledging you shouldn't be. Here. Right. It's yeah. real hot in that attic. Did you guys go up there? I didn't go, I didn't go The go floor up, is no. soft. Yeah. It's soft. It's yeah, I started right following him into the bird part, and then I'm like, I wonder if this is I know, safe. I and I'm like, well, I started stepping on nails, and I was like, yeah, nah, I, was like, like I don't know if this is safe. I stopped. I had to pull one out of my shoe, and I was like, that's... Honestly, he's probably just going to have the city do it because this guy already technically out. don't manage it. Because he already sold to a wholesaler. I thought he was having the wholesaler sell it for him. Yeah, whatever. Same difference. Yeah, I, I don't really ever want to come back. So. If you had to come back, what would the conditions be? That this house is 
vacant lot, like just an open field. Yeah, that lot belongs to this house back here. He says he's gonna check, and he even acknowledged too. He's like, I look. All the, these uh, bushes are perfect cover for what they're trying to do. Yeah, absolutely. I looked on the website though, and it's seven properties. There's yeah, that's part of them. There's. Yeah, this is their garage to that. Yeah, when house. we first started walking up, he goes, "Nice job on these bushes." I'm like, "Are you guys good?" Or are you good? Or? Uh, we're good. I think we're yeah, straight now. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you guys for your Thank time. You And just like that, we get murdered. I was gonna say, yeah. <laughs> there was an Narcan over there? I missed it. No, it's just like the. Oh, yeah, that's definitely an Narcan. Yeah, I started taking video upstairs because I didn't know what the last of you guys would be here. Go. Oh, they never I'm like, shouldn't they be going first? Like that way, you know, if somebody yeah. pops out there, yeah. yeah. Damn, dude, anybody need five bike tires? Oh, yeah. Nah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's probably diabetic, dude. Yeah, dude, these people are just mad diabetic. Tons of info. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> What's this truck back here? That's I think what that's... he asked me, and I said it. It's been here every time I've been here. But. Oh, I thought it was the inspector's truck. Oh, no. Yeah, I was about to get an inspector, but he said it's fine. Yeah, he's like a city truck. Yeah, he's like a city truck. I mean... Yeah, I don't know. It's interesting. There's a lot of... It is? Interesting, interesting. shit here. What's in it? Anybody open this door? The broomstick? It's on? like a storage closet. Is it a crackhead hiding in there? Ugh. Oh, it's tied. Uh, well, here, hold this. <laughs> Superhuman man strength. <laughs> Great. There's another thing we haven't brought up. No, it's just. I'm a, kidding. Uh, there's there's a door in there, but you would have to move all this shit. They probably will have to board it up anyway. It wasn't exactly secured. Just want to let you guys know. Just tore a fucking the extension cord in there. Man. All right, well, I guess I'll get Well, now I feel bad for fucking this up. <laughs> I feel... Fuck it. We should hillbilly board it with just the boards that they left from... Just oh, I gotta with do... all the debris. I want to do the side of the house because I know the, uh, the electric meters are going to be all fucking jerry-rigged. Oh, yeah. Oh, good. He said we can board these. If anyone there, or they can. Yeah, because then, then, the city bills the owner. If he never pays, they put a lien on the yeah, house, and now he can't sell. Our problem is his problem. Yeah, make it, make it their problem like that. I was just thinking we could Down, you stay here, you come. I'll pick you up later. <laughs> Have fun, man. Be safe out here. Yeah, yeah. remember all the crap from the eviction that was here? That's right, yeah, boy. Yeah, it's in the I'm middle unit. Though, they took it back in. <laughs> yeah, it's all in the middle unit. I saw that. The oh, couch and everything. Over the He said they can do it, I don't fucking care. They must have had a hell of a time getting in with that front door. I mean, that thing is big shit. They really wanted to get in. Dude, this That's is like on, behind, dude. This is on the street. And somebody just booted this. Well, the, the inspector mentioned like the bushes here are perfect. Yeah. Perfect. That's why I never got the eviction trash. Perfect. Yeah, that's yeah, like, right. I don't reason I look bad. And our sign was still... Right. And I was like, that's amazing. That's usually the first thing we do. Yeah, John said the city can do it that way. He doesn't want our guys getting fucked with people yeah. here. Yep. Stuff, so. Makes sense. Perfect. Now I need to get 25 more minutes of somebody just kicking the shit out of this door real quick. <laughs> open it. No, no don't open it. Yeah, I think. I need this bit. I need this bit. I need When you pulled up today, was there anybody here? No. So they well, saw the, the notice. The, the inspector joked, he's like, well, they can read. 
I mean, maybe. You should have made two. You should have one in English and one in Spanish. <laughs> Como estas? So make sure you guys get the message. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. Holy crap. Let's open right up. That way, things were paying off. I, mean, I, didn't, I didn't even touch <laughs> it. Let me see. That. I'm going to walk through this one, should too. You see what he did in San Dusky. He lowered that shoulder and the whole wall came. Dude, that door was made out of paper mache or whatever softer than paper mache. It was like this one. I put a hand on it. After you went through it, probably? Yeah. Yeah, I came back around front. He's already in there. I put a hand on it and it just went bonk. <laughs> Damn, dude. They cleaned this up. Yeah. There's like half the amount of garbage that was in here. You think that's a piss bucket? Or a general purpose fecal um, material bucket? I'd say piss bucket. That's the overwhelming smell in here, it's mostly piss anyway. Howdy! Howdy, neighbor! Oh, we got a piss truck over here in the corner too. Yeah, dude. I bet there's shit on the floor like there is in the other one. Like there's my bowling ball last time. Well, we don't speak about that, you know. That just kind of happened. <laughs> it was a moving incident. Yeah, it looks like they took all the trash that was in the living room and then just moved it into the kitchen. King Cobra, baby. The drink of champions. Yeah, we were going with Vince and Gary. We were going to board all those up. And, yeah, everything I got boarded up, got taken right right now. Except for that window. I used the extra one to screw that one. Okay, we're going to want to go. Let's still board it up. Wow. Just keep Yo! It's most of a mild right here, dude. Oh, see, yeah, that's why it came open so easy. There's no... Oh. They pulled the cylinder out. Okay. It's that crackhead ingenuity. <laughs> Bye. The cylinder right out of the, the deadbolt. Oh. I don't know how they did that. Because they didn't take the deadbolt off or the back piece. They just really fucked up. Oh, yeah, they did. No, that's from one. I think yeah, that's changed a lot. Hold on, let me just lock this up real quick. Hey, go ahead. There we go. <laughs> Fucking. Hey, it worked. I like that they spray painted over the part where it said "Police order, do not enter." Yeah. That's cool. Fucking hate. Fucking hate the ghetto. Mm-hmm. You know where stuff like this doesn't happen? Anywhere outside of Cleveland. Pretty much. Any any actual suburb. I just saw Cleveland was one of the number one worst neighborhood to live in, in the United States. Who voted on that? I would have put in my vote for it. Yeah, I lived in Cleveland a long time. Place is a dumpy. Man, hopefully this guy does all the lead work here. He's got a lot of work to do. Bro, bring in a bulldozer. I want to see that when that happens. That's the lead work that needs to be done. Yeah, I'd love to see that. Oh, the banisters broke. Yeah, it looks like somebody ate it. It does. Fucking beavers over here, dude? It's fucking... Just gnawing no. through the post? No, those are over off Jasper, according yeah, to that maybe inspector. Maybe they moved over here. We got them out of the basement with Jasper, and they came here. Damn. Yeah, the dude said, too, he's like, if I see your sign, can I just reach out? And I'm like... Please. I'm like, there's no guarantee we still manage it. There's a lot of buildings that have our sign on it, but I'll let you know either way. Yeah. Well, I'm going to cut it here. That was fun, guys. Yeah, no, it's not one of the cool Everybody say bye to the YouTubes. Holt Parkway. Bye. Crack House Adventure. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.